I'll move out. There you go. There yeah. you go. Nice. Perfect. Champ house, fellas. Oh, Matty Wootkins. Oh, yes. So we got a Vic Classic Wootkins. Originally New South Wales, like us. Newcastle. Another Newcastle refugee. Yeah. Move to Vic. On Q. This is actually a really big match. Yeah. Because Q lost a set to mm -hmm. someone who wasn't a top three seed. Ah, so if he loses this, he might not He's make it out? Yeah. Wow. The stakes. What was Wiccan seated? Second? I think second in the pool, yeah. Yep, fair enough. Um, and third in the pool, I think there's no technique. Okay. Who's currently projected first. Wow. Anarchy. Yeah. Well, I mean, this is the kind of character, Bayo, in this game that is so rare to be played that if you don't know the matchup, you can have a bit of trouble. I mean, they've got Bayonetta in, the, in Adelaide. Who plays Bayo here? Jamie. I'm not as familiar with. Jamie? Jamie, okay. Yeah. So they should know what's up. Yeah, I mean, I think Jamie's been running, like, he's been, like, winning. Mm hmm So, but I don't know if he's been as active recently. Yeah. But when he was playing, he's doing really, really well. Sweet. Appreciate you having the, the pulls up. Yeah. The info. So... Q lost to Lyoko. Yep. And Wootkins also dropped a game to no technique, which is also dangerous. So the games, the game count matters yeah. in this one. Okay. So it goes um, set wins mm. is the most important, and then head to head. And I noticed there's a, a DQ in the pool. How will that affect? Well, so everyone York? just gets a win off that. Right. But it means like there'll be less. There's less to discern between if yeah. like one person got an edge to one. Many games. Yeah. Okay. So every so every set matters more yeah. in terms of the placing in this pool. So current, if Wiccan wins this set, he'll get first mm. because he'll have the head-to-head -head on Q and no technique. Okay. Um, and this is his only set left to play. Yep. Oh, this is both of their only sets left to play. All right, well, that's so, exciting. Nick has played all of his sets already. Yep. Um, so I think regardless, regardless of the outcome, Nick's gonna get third. So this is for first and first and second is between these two. Okay. He's playing Mewtwo. That's exciting. We don't. Oh man, it's gonna get combo for days. Yeah, right. This, I don't understand this pick, because it's my understanding Q has very deep pockets. Corrin, Yoshi, Greninja, like, oh my so many goodness. options. Um, you'd think Yoshi would probably be the pick. Mm. Um, but I don't know, maybe he's just playing Mewtwo today. Clearly we're gonna, he knows something oh. we don't. Yeah. Um, we'll see how it goes, but I imagine Wukong's probably pretty comfortable. Yeah, I would say so. We don't have... Too much. I mean, Extra is playing Mewtwo a bit in Vic. That's pretty much it. And uh, we got Dusk, who is yeah. probably mid-level. Yeah, just missing that back air there. Great DI by Q. Yeah, you can... Mewtwo's a bit awkward to combo sometimes. Just, oh, my Wow, God. was that a roll-in? Yeah, yeah, that was a roll-in. Disgusting. Basically the only thing that would have hit him oh. at that distance. And answering right yeah, back, yeah. working with that dirty down air. Reads for reads. Alright, here's 60. Wow, okay. Put the jump. Roll in again. Maybe a little bit nervous. Weakens or yeah. Q? Yeah. Oh wow. Usually the um the Bayo short off side B is pretty hard to deal with. Mm -hmm. But it looks like Shadow Ball just wins. Right, because of how large he is. Yeah. Yeah, I know Weakens is very witch time happy, so um, if Q's not careful uh, yeah, with the range, he could definitely lose his stocks to to a stray witch time on the Shadow Ball. Oh, the tech chase? Yeah, see, the floatiness of Mewtwo is kind of messing up with the combo. Mm. Yeah, that's interesting, because you'd think with the tail, he would quite comfortably follow him around. But... Yeah, but he's kind of getting out of the top of the combos. Mm. Yeah, like SAIing up. Yeah. I mean, which, it can be chased. Oh, again! Wow, twice. So he, so Wiccans is getting up, afraid of the Shadow Ball, yeah, and then... Rolling. Oh wow. Oh! Okay. Wait, that was so sick though. Yeah, the way he waited out the air dodge and followed. Okay, that doesn't do too much. Oh! He Great. pulled the air dodge with it. So good. These players both playing that, like, kind of take a hit, wait, see if they, they panic, and yeah. then hit them harder. 
much harder than if you just go for the true stuff, right? Yeah, for sure. Okay, dash attack. Yeah, oh. great punish. That almost That's killed. That's really strong. Yeah. Bayo known for pretty linear options in neutral. Kind of hard to get in on people if they know your your side um, side B in or. He's waiting for it. Yeah. Luke's in a bad spot. Uh, this is really bad percent to be at because up throw, up throw will also kill. Far oh, out. Right. Yeah, yeah, and you're not you can't which time the throws. Yeah. It opted for forward throw. Probably just quite comfortable with the ledge traps, considering both stocks he's got so far have been on a on the ledge. On oh. the ledge. Stray dash attack taking it. Held in on the DI. Could have mm. lived, but he was holding in. Yeah, I mean that's the advantage of those like bursty dash attacks. You're often yeah. you're still dashing or it's like Pikachu dash attack. Yeah, exactly. You don't even expect to get hit, so your DI is way off. Yeah. Like all they have to do is call you you dashing in mm. and you're hard DIing in and you'll die like dead. fifty percent sooner than you should. Because mm, 'cause you're going straight up. Alright, we can staring into the abyss. Yeah. Q uh looking pretty comfortable. Yeah, I mean the Mewtwo pick was actually really good. Yeah. We we doubted. But he he knew about the rolls. Like from mm. the get go, he knew. And he thought, hey, who do I have that can punish rolls the hardest? Mewtwo just Mewtwo down smash. Man. It is like a gun. It's like a magic gun. Yeah. It's that Game & Watch archetype with like slow startup, no end lag yeah, kind is. of move. And like super strong. Mm. We've gone to Hollow Bastion. Yep, staying the Mewtwo. Probably Bayonetta's best stage. Because small blast zone. Small blast zone, nice platform for you. Yep. Um, other than Town & City I guess, Town & City probably. Okay, but then people aren't going to leave it open. Yeah. yeah. It's rare to see Wiccans get one-off hits that don't convert into larger it's, combos. It's really strange. Yeah. He needs to figure out what the best way to chase the floatiness is. Mm. Mewtwo's air dodge, not quite as good as it used to be in prior games, but uh, definitely getting him out of trouble here. Dude, the back air is putting in work. Wow. Okay, should That's fine. punish. No punish oh, on that so, jab. So normally like you roll in on a jab, right? Yep. But he let it go early. So that the, the roll in was doing. Yeah, because he didn't get to that 11th hit. Yeah. Mm. Yep. That's the classic. Try and jump in on, Bern on Bayonetta and get side beat. Yep. You can see him adapting to it, kind of slowing down with the Shadow Ball. Yeah, looking out for dash attack. Alright. Is it back throw? Okay. Opting to get him off stage. Oh, wow. he actually pulled that jump. Yeah. Just slightly out of, out of range to get that forward air, though. That could be big. Uh... Just oh, God, that's strong. Yeah. They are so light. You can see that after getting all the stocks with the roll, Q's trying to cover the, the jumps much more now, probably assuming that Wukong's just going to panic jump yeah. as a result of dying those ways in the past. Which, it has been the correct call, he's just missed space a bit. Yeah. You know what they say, if you don't get the timing as well as the option, it's not a rig. That's true. Oh! Wow. That's actually crazy. At that high percentage roll. But he didn't have time to get in on that forward smash. Yeah, I think oh. Wiccans, if he wants to take these, he's going to need to weigh out these air dodges from you two. Yeah. He's getting away with a lot of them mid-combo. Yeah. If he's not finding big combos, you need to bait the defensive options. Q's playing so well. Just spacing him out with the projectile. Okay, nice. This could be death, actually. Yeah. yeah, solid. If Mewtwo's so big, you can't really DI to live there. I see. What Wait, happened? what? Oh no. Probably thought he had another up B or... Another jump. Something like that. Right, this could be some big damage. Yeah, answering back pretty quick. Oh, nice. Wow, 67% right off the bat. He nearly chased that onto stage as well. Alright, you need to be super patient here if you're working. You need to wait for the options. Mm. Oh, dash attack. The dash attack's just in neutral, doing so much. Yeah, well, it's just going to completely snuff out um, ABK on the ground, right? Oh, I just missed. And there's that Aedorch again, just getting him out tax free. Yeah. The Shadow Ball's so scary here. Mm. Yeah, <laughs> just one B breast can yeah. end your stuff. Okay, what's the option? Yeah. Delayed double Up jump. Yeah. Wrong way there. 
You can't reverse it. Yeah, you just have to do up to back air whichever way it is. Oh yeah, why is that? Too slow? Yeah. Nice. Yeah. Wiccans loves AB King to cross people up from ledge and yeah, then back air. Yeah. They try to punish it. Exactly. They keep thinking that they've got the time. Yeah. This is still such a bad spot to be in. Uh, a yeah. grab will kill. Them. Absolutely, with like any throw he likes except for with throw. Yeah. No, oh, down throw too, I guess. But. Shadow Ball's gonna kill. Oh! Wow. Okay. Yeah, and that's the first time he's actually pulled the trigger on a Shadow Ball while he was off stage, first time he threw too. It out. Yeah, yeah it usually he just holds onto it for the ledge trap, so. Yeah, that was great super play. Super dominant. Mmm. You know, Q convincingly taking that set.